Alright, what is up everyone? Bo here from BZ Hub. We're playing on Layton right now, playing some Layton multiplayer. It's been great. There's a lot of new uh, players out here with their game they bought during the sale. And uh, I will tell you, one of my favorite things is that there are a good amount of great looking animals on people's maps right now. I mean, look at me, even at a four, this one's a pretty good looking four right here. But obviously this five is, uh, is the stuff of legends when it comes to elk. And I am really looking forward to uh, getting in range of that beast. So just to go over the weapons while we have them. We have the Hudzik 50 cal muzzle loader on number one here. On number two, we have the Almighty Solokine. Number three, we have the M1 Evanique, which we'll be using on this elk over here. And then at number four, we have the Miller 10 gauge. And I'm carrying around slugs and I'm carrying around birdshot in case we find some ducks or some rabbits that we want to take out with those with uh with this guy it's always a question of how close you want to get when uh, you're playing on multiplayer servers because you never want to uh, take too much time and then who knows what happens you get disconnected or they kick you for some reason maybe they were holding the spot for a friend um, so I would really like to get up close and take some photos of this guy but I don't know if it's worth taking the chance. I know that the server host has kind of been uh, AFK for the past, oh gosh, 15 minutes or so, but I don't know if he'll come back and kick me out or, or what. That is a great looking bull though. So just to let everyone know, this is uh, where we are right now. This is actually where I shot my first level five elk. And it is one of my favorite spots ever since then, just because there's a cabin really close to here that you can just walk on down to this spotting tower. I'll, I always walk down to this spotting tower just so I don't spook anything. And then I walk south from there and it gives you a good look at the whole lake there. Just so you make sure you don't miss anything. There's that big level four there. And I think the level five is behind him some black tail walking next to us. Oh no, that's an elk. Great, that guy's gonna go over there and mess everything up. There's our level five. He's walking. If he, if he does turn broadside, I might just go ahead. Yep, looks like he might be giving us a chance here. Oh. Waiting for that highlight to go away. There we go. Using that follow up. With the M1, the M1 gives you a great follow-up. And we got a great lung shot on the level five there. And it looks like we might have gotten that decent sized level four as well. Which one do we have here? This looks to be the four. 263. It's actually short of a gold. Wow. There he is. Look at that. I have to look at my... Just to make sure. I do have the tracks on. They're just really not putting any tracks down. Look at this guy. In that morning latent sun. You couldn't ask for too much more. All right, let's not mess around too much more. Let's take a look at this guy. Will he be a diamond with the new M1 Evanique? Oh, he's a gold. My goodness gracious, 277. How is that possible? How is that possible? 
<laughs> oh my goodness. Well, let's taxidermize him just so we don't lose him. Looks like we might be running into an issue that we're having with some other animals in the game right now. Um, where their uh, trophy rating isn't being figured correctly. But maybe not. Maybe he's just a really small level 5. Does say on the old scoring sheet a diamond elk would be 1,053 pounds. But of course this guy is 1,059 which should put him way over uh, diamond there. But uh, look at the true score there. An awesome set of antlers, anyway. Definitely got the length. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Wow, so he's really only a five by seven. If anything, maybe that's the reason he's not a diamond. Maybe it's because he's uh, totally missing some, uh, some, some things there. Look at that. Look at the difference in uh, left versus right there. 16 points of difference. Wow. That would have, uh, well, let's see. It would have put him right at uh, 83, 93, 293. That's still a long ways off from 380. <laughs> so uh, maybe maybe the trophy rating's off. I'm not. I'm not completely sure. Definitely a nice trophy though, level 5 elk. You can't complain when you see one of these monsters. One of these monsters in your sights can't do too much better than that. Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you all for watching. Just a short little one of a nice level 5 elk right there. Uh, can't complain with that. Level 5 elk. I love them. I love them. I'll mount them on my trophy lodge any day of the week. Uh, if you didn't, you'd be insane. Uh, on Twitch, catch us streaming Monday, Wednesday, sometimes Friday, 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. Central. Hope to see you there. Chat it all out with you. Um, even if we find big mess up level 5 elk like this. <laughs> Still a great time to talk with everyone in the community. See how everyone's doing. Um, yeah. It's awesome. Join us on our Discord or our Instagram to see other pictures and uh, share your trophies with other Hunter Call the Wild fans. And that's going to do it. As always, everyone, keep hunting, never stop.